Hey guys, it's Arika Misha in the kitchen getting ready to cook it up and today I'm jumping right into it. Today we have the Bertoli Shrimp Scampi Leguini. I have three of them sitting over here. Y'all give me a second. Uh oh, hold on you all. Let me get out my shrimp because yes, I'm going to be adding extra shrimp to this because I've cooked this before and those shrimps in there are too small for me. So I've got some pre-cooked uh, jumbo shrimp already seasoned here. I got onion garlic, Old Bay in there. Y'all know what I say because he an Old Bay. I got Old Bay in there, uh, on onion garlic, Old Bay, a little salt, a little pepper, and that's about it. I didn't want to do too much because the shrimp scampi already has its own flavor. All right, so we got our shrimp over here. We're gonna get ready to add those in once we get everything done over here. I did put two tablespoons of um, Bertoli oil in my pan. And one thing I like about these Bertoli meals, they are quick and easy. Quick and easy. All you're doing is just dumping them in. All right, got my first bag in there. I wanted to do four bags. It's not much in the bags. I mean, it looks like it's a lot, but it's not. Let me bring y'all over so y'all can see. Bring y'all out of the darkness and into the light. That's what he'll do. Let me see. All right, we're going to make that the word of the day. God will bring you out of the darkness into the marvelous light. Yep, that is the word of the day. Y'all know what that means. All right, let me get this second one in. Like I said, I wanted to do four bags because I know how these, these are gonna bake down. It looks like a lot, but it's not. It's gonna bake down. I wanted to do four, but they only had three bags. So I was like, all right, I just have to have three bags. All right, let me get this third bag in here. And of course, I'll give y'all a close-up of everything that comes in your bag. All right. Wait, got something else in there. Uh-uh. Get all my stuff. Hold on. All my stuff I paid for. Okay. So, let me read to you guys what's on the bag. The shrimp scampi linguine. Shrimp with linguine and bell peppers and a creamy garlic sauce. Yes. We've had these before. They are delicious. Just keep them frozen in your... Uh, in your freezer and when you're ready to cook them put a little oil in your pan I'm gonna put the top on but I want to show you guys everything these are the linguine noodles let me give you a close-up of that the linguine noodles all right and of course your pepper your red pepper the red pepper it's got a shrimp see the little small shrimp and they're gonna cook down got the shrimp and you have your garlic sauce kind of cubed up but it'll melt down and that's pretty much it for the uh, shrimp shrimp scampi this is your uh, scampi garlic sauce I showed you guys that all right and the only thing I'm gonna do is let this just cook itself down like I told you guys I put two tablespoons of Bertoli oil whatever kind of oil you got put it in the bottom of your pan to help everything get it done and put my top on like that we're gonna give it a few minutes you know so i can get it all heated up let me zoom y'all into that look how beautiful that looks let me take the top off doesn't that look beautiful and it tastes so good y'all quick and easy meal to get you in and out of the kitchen but the meal tastes like you've been you know cooking it all day that's what i'm talking about good quality meals that don't take you all day to cook so this is going to be done in no time. So, I'm going to go ahead, let it get itself cooked down a little bit more, and um, I'll be back to show you guys. So, let me get it covered so that he can make it do what it do. And we'll be back. Oh, I forgot to show y'all. I'm also doing some Publix garlic bread sticks. The Publix garlic bread sticks. These are really good, y'all. These have become our favorites. Uh, six sticks. Let me zoom y'all out. Yep, it's six six in a box, and um, 
You just put the oven on 375 and put it in the oven for like nine minutes. Yep, 375 on the bread six. 375 for seven to nine minutes. I do it for nine minutes. And that's it. And those garlic uh, sticks are really, really good. So let me go ahead, let me get this cooked down a bit. And then when I come back, I'll show y'all how it looks as, um, as it cooked down. And I'm gonna add those shrimps. I'll be back. Okay guys, we're back. Looks like it's kind of, as you guys can see, I'm going to take you guys in so you can see how it has cooked down. See that big old pile has cooked its way down. I'm going to go ahead and add my extra shrimp. Let me give it a stir first so you guys can see how it looks. Show you guys how it looks now. Let me zoom y'all in so y'all can really see. And then I'll add these shrimps. My jumbo shrimp. Give you guys a good look at it. You guys can see the linguine noodles, the peppers, and the shrimp, as you can see. Shrimp really ain't that big. See what I'm saying? So, got all these noodles. I mean, some people like it like that. You know, with a bunch of noodles, not that much meat, just a bunch of pasta. Yeah, no. I mean, some meat. So, let's go ahead and add our shrimp. Get the shrimp added in there. Stir that up. Oh yeah, oh, that's going to be real good now that I added those big jumbo shrimp. Mm, mm, mm. Whole house smell like a nice Italian restaurant. Restaurante. I don't know if that's Italian. I don't know. Anyway, y'all, something like that. The garlic bread cooking in the oven. The shrimp scampi. Oh, smells so good. And then all the flavors I put on the shrimp is now going into the linguine. Oh, smells so good. Mm, mm, mm. Now look at it. Now that I, let me take y'all back in. Oh, y'all still zoomed in. See, now look at it. Now that I've added those jumbo shrimps. Those shrimps gives it life. Gives it more. And those little tiny little shrimps. Mmm, 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 mmm. Look at those jumbo shrimps. Oh, let me see if I can get a nice big scoop of shrimp for y'all. Oh, yeah. Here it goes. The shrimp and the peppers. Oh, don't that look so good, y'all? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that looks good. I'm taking y'all in. Because you know why? Because I'm going to get the people what they want. Y'all came to see the food. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. I think I might make that my thumbnail right there. Yep. Okay, all right, let's see. Let's get it stirred up some more. Mm, 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 mm. Smells amazing. Oh, my garlic bread gonna be through in a minute. Mm, 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 mm. All right. Get some of them shrimp out on top there. So I can take my pictures for Instagram. Don't forget to go over on Instagram and follow me guys. At Arika Misha on Instagram. Come over on Instagram. Show me some uh, love and support over there as well guys. Trying to grow my Instagram channel. Well you know my Instagram page. Bring y'all out. Oh. Bring y'all out. Yes. Don't that look so good y'all? That's it, y'all. We've completed the meal. Quick and easy meal, I'm telling y'all. And <clears throat> Bertoli, they've got all kind of flavors. All kind of flavors in the store. Um, so, make sure y'all go check Bertoli out. We love Bertoli. Y'all know we love Bertoli over here. So, all right, y'all. Uh, let me see. I think the garlic bread should be finished. Let me at least bring that out. I don't want to end the video without showing y'all that garlic bread. Yep, garlic bread is done. Cut my timer and stove off. Show y'all that garlic bread. Oh yeah. 
Oh boy, that garlic bread, nice and hot. Bring y'all out. Bring y'all over here to the garlic bread. So y'all can see what that's looking like. Oh yeah. Mm 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 mm. That's the garlic bread, y'all. Take y'all in real quick. That's Publix garlic bread. That's the twister bread. And uh, yeah, that's it. I'm going to add nothing to the bread. The bread's got its garlic and everything on it. That's some really good bread. And all right, y'all. That's it. That's all. Y'all seen me do it. So you know I did it. Taking y'all back in again. So y'all get a good look at that pasta before I go. All right, guys. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, that knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.